You want to know what real life nursing is all about? This is the Daily Round Show by NRSNG.com. Hey guys, what's up? Susan with NRSNG. So I wanted to talk to you all about pharmacology. Pharmacology made me angry. <laughs> I hated pharmacology. I did not understand it. I struggled through it the entire time. I felt like when I left pharmacology, I knew about the same as when I started pharmacology. I was petrified of all of the different kinds of farm questions that you would get on the NCLEX or any other of my tests in that regard. So if I was taking a med surge test, I was like, oh, there's a question about a medication on here. I, and I would like instantly just decide I didn't know anything. Um, <laughs> so how do you study? What are some tips and tricks for studying for farm? Well, I'd start off by saying that you need to memorize and learn generic names first. Don't even worry about the brand names. Brand names, although they're more commonly used, like in the hospital and things like that, I always had memorized the generic names first because you have to have a generic name on every medication and on every test they're gonna give you a generic name and your generic names have um, suffixes and prefixes that can help you figure out what the actual drug is. And speaking of suffixes and prefixes, you need to memorize those. So what are your olals or what are your stats? And come up with fun ways to remember it. I, for my statins, I, you guys are all gonna think this is really crazy, but <laughs> I would say if you don't do something stat and get it in now, you're gonna get a lot of lip. So your lipids will go up if you don't take your statins. If you take your statins and you do everything quick, it'll go down and you will have less lipids. That was one way that I remembered it. That probably makes no sense to anybody else in the world, but I still remember it to this day. <laughs> That's what I think when someone comes in and says they take a statin, I'm like, yeah, so that you don't have any lip. Lip is, <laughs> but that's how I remember it. So you guys have to come up with something funny for yourselves. Try and figure out what it is that you are going to use for memorizing each one of your sections and take it piece by piece. So if you're overwhelmed with what you're learning, I know you need to learn everything in the farm, right? Cause that's what they are teaching you. Like it's like a, taking a sip of water out of a fire hose or like, here is everything you need to know. And you're like, I'm not sure I got any of that. <laughs> What you need to do is at least learn something. So slow it down. Even if you know you don't end up getting every single question on that test right, you're gonna get 75% of them right, which is passing or whatever it is. And I know everybody wants to be an A student. I know I did. I was very st stuck on that. I had to be the A student. But, <laughs> you know, it's better to learn some of it than to kind of sort of learn little bits and pieces of all of it and not know really any of it. Good luck studying for farm. You guys can do this. Check out our pharmacology course. It's awesome. It rocks. It's written by a pharmacologist turned nurse. Rock on. So it's like the best of the best. Okay, you guys, you can do it. Take your time. Study as much as you can. And um, I hope you guys can come up with some funny things. You should leave me comments on some funny tips and tricks that you guys have for memorizing some of your silly drugs. All right. See y'all tomorrow.